Welcome on in. Today we have some wild video from the homie Bizarre Buff. Something that... If you've ever seen the show Cops... Drop a thumbs up, subscribe if you're new. Then you know how suspenseful the show could be. I've never seen Whether it. it's the suspense or the authentic, non-scripted events that take place in the show. Mm. There's something about it that has us on the edge of our seat. However, uh -oh. what I find really interesting about the show is the fact that some episodes are heavily edited. Most things that happen in the show are cut out. But it makes me wonder, what exactly are they cutting out? Could it be incidents that are not suitable for audiences? Incidents that are too disturbing? Or Yo, is it something else? I feel like some massive plot twist about to come. The reason why I say this is because there have been cases in which officers have dealt with situations that weren't crime related, but rather something beyond that. Beyond explanation. Something paranormal. Hey! Hey! And this next video is proof of some of those situations in which officers could not explain the stuff they've witnessed. This video was posted on Twitter by a police officer. That plot twist came out of nowhere. Sir from Brazil, who was part of a police operative that took place inside an abandoned hospital. Needless to say, the footage he caught on camera is pretty creepy to say the least. My guy got the MP5 already. Caralho, bicho, que que é isso, mano? Cuidado, Judá. Cuidado, mano. Que que é isso, mano? Mano, não tem nada. Caralho, mano, que que é isso, bicho? Yo, if I see something... Caralho, mano. Yo, I'm about to bust, bro. Hey! Mano, que que é isso, bicho? Damn! Caralho, oh, mano, bora, mano. That's a bad... They need to change that door immediately right now, bro. Bro. Immediately. Vai, mano, vai, vai, mano. Vai, mano, vai, mano. Vai, vai, mano. <laughs> What just happened? The door opens and closes back and forth all on its own. This surely is pretty strange. Not much info was given on the video, except that it was shot in Brazil by an officer during a police operation. What just happened? With that said, based on what's available, including the footage itself, it seems like this might be actual evidence of something paranormal caught on camera. How many of you think it just needs a brand new door and it will solve the problem? Bruh. Of course. What do you make of this video? And I'll leave it up ran. to you to decide. They sprinted. They sprinted. The video definitely has a creepy vibe, but the number The following two. video hey. was submitted by Party Shiba. And I have to say that this video is by- Bro, that scared me. I thought that was like a demonic lady just looking at by me. By far the creepiest thing I've seen. Hey. Along with this video, Party Shiba states, My old friend from high school made a YouTube channel a long time ago and uploaded a strange video. The video consists of him joking around with his younger sister, pretending to take a photo of her, but filming her instead. The reason as to why he uploaded the video is because in it... Man, I remember when YouTube used to look like this. Crazy times, man. We really be growing old, huh? It's crazy. Smash that like button, subscribe, and let's gr grow old together. Now I'm saying let's, let's, let's bond, man. Let's bond. He saw something odd happen to no her homo. hair no on the right side of the screen. I recall him having sleep issues back in high school as he claimed that there have been a lot of strange things happening inside his house. The details are fuzzy, but I think that his sister in the video also claimed to have seen her grandparents, who were no longer around. Damn. That is all I have, but it is strange. Here's the video that Party Shiba is referring to. Be sure to pay close attention to the right side of her hair, or you'll miss it. Hey, right side, he said? Oh, okay. Hey, we're gonna take you a picture, okay? Ready? Hey, 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 I think Ready? it's gonna appear like some hand or something like. Uh -huh. Yo, yo, the hair is. Yeah, hmm? Okay, we're done. Just that. No, I'm just kidding. Baby, no, baby, we baby. need to go take the picture again. Go. Bruh, what just happened? As always, what are your thoughts on this? 
That freaked me out, though. That's nothing, bro. It's nothing. The following picture got, was submitted by Gareth. I got catfished. There was nothing, really. Just the hair stood up and it got scared you for no yeah. reason, bro. Who, along with this photo, writes, In 2017, I went on vacation to Mexico. Dang. I was there to visit some relatives. My family is from Veracruz, and the town at which they live in is pretty creepy, as people have heard strange and scary things about the place. One night, both my brother and my uncle, including myself, were sitting inside my aunt's restaurant. I was watching the entrance while my brother and uncle played with their iPad. They would play with the iPad's camera and take random photos. This kept them entertained as there wasn't much for them to do at the restaurant. Right before closing- It's crazy that back in the days people would take random photos to entertain themselves, right? Crazy, because it, this was new technology, right? Now people people only take pictures whenever somebody gets in drama, whenever somebody gets in a fight, that's when everybody's like, okay, we're gonna hold up, let me record, now you can fight. That's, I mean, damn, man, let, like, time. society, They man. were both looking at the photos they took. I wasn't there with them looking over at the photos, but... But. It was upon looking at their faces that I realized something was wrong. Damn, something They bad. had a look of sheer terror on their face. I asked them what was wrong, to which they replied, Did you see any women walking by? I answered no. I was confused. They then showed me the photo they were looking at. Yeah. I immediately got chills. I was so unnerved by what I saw in this photo. Oh my god. Near okay, the I'm entrance, ready. there appears to be a woman. However, if you look closely, she appears to have a distorted face and a really long neck. Is that a stock photo? Stock photo. I right? ran outside the restaurant to see if the woman in this photo was still around. Show the, the streets photo. were empty, as usual. Keep in mind that I was looking at the entrance the whole time I was there. I only looked away for a minute since I was using my phone. But even while looking away, I was sure that nobody passed by. There was barely any business that night. We ended up going to bed early, as we were totally freaked out by what happened. Damn. To this day, we have no photo? idea as to what was in that photo. All right, the plot is technically to get it, but show us the photo, show us the photo. Here's the picture that Yuvi is talking about. Hey. Hey, okay, that's a, not nothing wrong, probably. You can somewhat see the long neck that Yuvia mentioned, but what stands out the most is the distorted face. Nah. This is definitely the stuff of nightmares. Bruh. This one's for sure pretty creepy. Okay, is it me, but it just looks pretty normal to me. Does it look normal to you or no? How, what, what you feel? How you feeling? How you feeling about this? There's something about abandoned places that give off uncanny- I loved his explaining more than the actual photo. The photo was basically not saying, but he actually got me there, any man. vibes. Whether it's the desolate atmosphere of the place, or the thought of someone or something inhabiting the building, there's Damn. just something about such places that keep you from visiting them. Whatever it might be, abandoned places carry creepy vibes. And this next video is no exception to that notion. Sometimes there are like people living there, just normal people that might not have a house. And some people probably have a fetish. Some people probably have like some sort of like weird addiction or whatever you call it, right? To actually live in houses. And sometimes there are actual crackheads out there too. So you gotta be careful going in those houses. The following video was submitted by Super Damn. Toxic Potato 75 Toxic who claims gamer. to have captured something unexplainable while staying over at a rundown building with some friends. Toxic Ghost Hunter! The video starts off with them entering the premises of the building and seeing nothing but leftover furniture. The reason as good. to why they came here in the first place is because of an incident that took place in that same building. This is not their first time coming here. They came here before. However, little mm. did they know that they would witness something really creepy. Dang. According to Super Toxic Potato, eek, the eek. first time they came here, he and his friends saw a door close on its own. Eek. It slammed itself shut all on its own, and they were terrified by this encounter. Dang. Ever since then, they've sought out to see this happen again, but this time while recording it. And to their surprise, eek. they did capture something. 
Hey, hey, hey. Take a look at the footage they captured. It's pretty spooky, to say the least. Oh, it's going down. I'm hyped for this video. Is anyone wearing red? Yeah. Damn. You're wearing maroon. He's just chilling. Hey, hey, hey. Put the light up. It's maroon. It's red. Stop. It's already an hour. Point it. Point at it. It's been an hour. One last. I'm gonna. Fuck. No fing way. Two rounds you fired. Did it. Two rounds fired. Thank you. You did it. There happened. As you can see, the door slammed on its own. It is Bruh. pretty creepy, but some viewers beg to differ. Some think that this might have been caused by the wind, as it could have been blowing towards the pathway of the door. Although this might be a possible explanation, Super Toxic Potato discredits that notion, as according to him, the door was slammed in the opposite direction of where the wind was coming from. As of right now, no further evidence has been brought forth to prove this paranormal occurrence as otherwise. But he and his friends are sure that this was done by some paranormal entity, a ghost. Damn. For now, it remains a mystery as it to- It might be a chihuahua, you know, a chihuahua maybe running around, push the door. What they caught on camera. Could be a chihuahua, man. It could be a chihuahua. Let's be real. Number five. Out of all places, the most talked about location at which many people have encountered scary and unexplainable encounters is a place in New Jersey known as Clinton Road. Damn. From satanic rituals and cults that people have encountered while hiking to a bridge where the ghost of a child is said to appear, Clinton Road is brimming with lots and lots nah, of strange- Nah, this is Cap. This is Cap. I've seen a similar ghost figure in another picture as well. Photoshop, probably. Strange activity. Just now, in case. although there are countless videos out there of said activity caught on camera, none of them come close to the following video you're about to see. Oh. The following footage was submitted by Rosie114, who, along with some friends, went on a hike to explore the wooded areas that surround this road. Mind you, that all of this took place in the middle of the night, Damn. which probably wasn't a good idea. Yeah. This is what Rosie 114 recorded after one of her friends saw something that scared the living daylights out of him. Rosie! Okay, let's see, man. Let's see what Rosie caught. The growl in the woods. Listen closely. This was her. This was heard right after the wind notices a man standing alone in the woods. Damn, I know y'all heard the gro growl. No, 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 no! <laughs> They're running. Okay, put the text. Uh, move the text. Bruh. Oh, oh, bro. In this see video, a man. Rosie states that there was a man standing alone, which should have raised some suspicion. Perhaps he too wanted to take a walk in the woods. That might explain it. The theories abound on this video, as viewers have come up with their own explanations. For now, nobody that, that growl could be a burp from the Shivava. Knows what Being Rosie hungry. and her friends came across. But this doesn't mean that the possibility of this being a paranormal occurrence is ruled out. This is Clinton Road after all. Who knows what else lurks within this place? Probably a Shivava that was In hungry. In this next submission, Andrea Cardini captured something unexplainable on camera. She sent both a video and a photo of the strange anomaly that was captured. Andrea writes, In 2018, I had my first trail cam, and, needless to say, the image and video I've attached are from that year. Mm. The trail cam only activates when it detects movement. However, One night, the trail cam was activated by a roe deer that passed by. Unfortunately, it left really quick before the camera fully activated. However, <clears> upon <throat> turning on, it captured something else. Deal. The trail cam was positioned in a valley on a palm tree. I share this footage for the first time online now. First time, I... Here's the footage that Andrea captured. It's pretty weird, but creepy nonetheless. This is that video. So, 
what's gonna happen. So that that light is that in the video or reflection? Oh damn! UFOs? Maybe? No moment. 2018 video. There appears to be an orb floating in place. Then, seconds later, it appears to teleport at a different spot. Probably a UFO. Along with this observation, Andrea writes, The floating orb thing is really weird. Stars don't act like that, and neither does the moon. Insects don't act like this, as they always appear semi- That's common knowledge! That's common knowledge, bro! It's certainly something different. Probably a UFO, maybe Chinese, Chinese, Chinese lantern. Maybe Chinese lantern or something. That's what they like to- Balloons! Drones! You know what I'm saying? These are the, the explanation, government explanation, bots explanation. Transparent on camera. As you can tell, Andrea is just as mesmerized as those who've seen this clip, and they're just as baffled as she is. What do you think this might be? I'm curious as to what you think this is. Let me know down below. Probably a UFO, I would say, right? This last video is pretty creepy, as what's captured in it is sure to keep you up at night. Oh, snap. Allie Wynn was shooting If you're about to sleep, okay? Do not look behind you. Don't look behind you. Video on TikTok. When, while editing the video, she saw something that left her spooked. Don't look behind you. Uh, exposure, what could happen? Maybe someone behind her here, like here? Maybe reflection here? I put the brightness up, y'all. Oh, hey. Yeah. That's like a literal kid, right? Oh, damn. Wow. And it disappeared. It sure is pretty unsettling damn. to see something like this. Allie has no idea as to what this might be. However, Allie thinks that this might be a ghost. It sure does look like it. She further adds that she might be moving out, as this has her really spooked. Doubtless, seeing something like this would give anyone nightmares. Mm. It's a good thing Allie doesn't plan on staying there any longer. Of course, she could be saying this as a joke. One thing's for sure though, if I were her, I'd leave the place in a heart immediately but ladies and gentlemen click on this video on the screen probably the scariest video to date click on it and i will see you right there subscribe